Hello my friends and welcome back to our continued blind let's play Dead Rising for PlayStation. My name is the Flatless Bird, this is your Soybeans Gaming Channel, and today, today we are on our way to try to fix the generator. Yeah, by going up a clock tower I think it is? I, I, I'm, I'm not really sure. I think we're just going to follow the pointing arrow. And then it looks like we probably need to get uh, the, 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 the bees. The thing about the bees is they may not be very easy to get because I was told by Dragon Darkness that the Nectar has a timer. So I don't think we could just chug infinite OJs or the OJ combiner things. Uh, yeah, um, but there is a ton of zombies, you know, where the car park is and the tunnels. So maybe we'll find more bees there. <laughs> Either way, let's get started, shall we? I hope you all having a wonderful, fantastic day today as we get started running. Now, if the, if there is a limit on Nectar, I think what we probably should do is we should probably start spamming uh, bees early. You know, I think we do move a little bit faster. I said it the other day that I didn't think we were moving faster. Maybe we are moving a little bit faster. Ah, uh, maybe, just maybe. All right, where are we? Yep, yep, yep. I thought that's where we were going. We're going to the middle of the park, which is horrible. Because that means we got to go past the, uh, the flying helicopter of death. Which is not something I'm really looking forward to. <laughs> yep, 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 yep. Although, uh, Techno Trouble showed in our Discord. By the way, if you're not part of our Discord, uh, link is in the description below. Come join our Discord. Love to talk to you. Uh, he showed a video of... Uh, some guy taking down the helicopter with the nail gun. It, it was pretty hilarious. Uh, I, I don't know if that's a good strategy or not, but it's it's a thing that happens. I love how all the zombies in the mall are dead, but there's a bunch of zombies outside here. I mean, there's a giant helicopter here for crying out loud. How is there not... How, how is there not more dead zombies out here? This helicopter is not doing a good job. Uh, he, he I mean, he needs to do better than that. Is the helicopter even out here now? I don't hear it. Huh. Well, either way, we are racing as fast as we can to the, uh, to this thingamajig. Totally getting Silent Hill vibes right now. Our outfit is so comical. Ratman shirt, white platinum hair. I mean, those shorts are way too tight. <laughs> At least we're not wearing the giant uh, surfbot helmet. I mean, that's a plus, right? I think it was weird. Uh, hello. I feel like Obi Wan Kenobi here. Why, hello there. Oh, I gotta go in there. Oh, this is. Damn it! Yeah, Even this is no brainer. If this leads out of here, I doubt these zombies would just let us walk right through. Oh, look at this! What are we gonna do about that? Um, can we borrow the helicopter? Oh, just had to say that, didn't I? How do I even get in there without getting eaten? Oh, it looks like it can't get in there. Um. There we go. You obtained a generator. Is this a helicopter? Get shot down? It's still there. It's still there. <laughs> run away! Run away! And he bravely ran away. Ran away, away, he did. Bravely ran away. Um, no objectives here. Yeah, I definitely think we are faster. Oh my gosh. I don't even want to know what's happening behind me. I just hear a ton of really, really horrific noises. All right. We could uh, get another bee here. 
No. Ah, I saw the nectar on. All right, well now I know you can't you can't do that to get infinite bees. So, yeah. It, oh, I mean it's good to know. It, it it is good to know what you can and can't do. Take a right. I am kind of worried about how many bees I'll need. Currently, I have enough for three. What's the nectar by itself? I just hope I can give her the bees. You know, I, I hope it doesn't say you have to get 15 bees. So I'm gonna have 15 spots in my inventory. Thank God you find a spare. Now I can get back to work. That was weird. While goes this plan, I should have just put all the equipment I need now. Bring me some adult queens and I can get started. <laughs> How many do you need? I, I should have just put all the equipment I need now. How many do you need? At least 10? At least 10? Oh, that's that's not good. That's not good at all. At least 10 bees. Oh my god. Well, we got two. I should I should probably make a uh should should um Turn a page here in my yay old book. And I should probably start tallying. So bees out of ten. Make two tally marks. Alright. Oh, they they've They've uh, hit them all again. Huh. So I gotta find... I gotta find ones with bees. That's not a bee. Guys, you're not doing your job. You're not doing your job. You should be killing these guys, not me. Okay, okay, where are we going? Uh, rah, rah, rah. uh, can I go in the tunnels through Shion's? I think so. So, what I do is I hit the save point, I go to Shion's, and then I go diving in the depths of the tunnels. I have a free heal that gives me a B, so that'll be three, and then I have three more spots, so that will be four, five, six, and then if I make one more run, one more run would be ten, so I have just the right number of inventory spots. Question is, can I find the Bs? Diving. Oh my god, no, I got that bug. I got that bug again. Ah, uh, what is with this bug? Save the game. Save the game. God, it's a crippling bug. What causes this? Alright, so I can return to tell screen. And I believe if I load, it, it should fix it. I don't know, that loading looks pretty wonky. Okay, now it looks a little bit better. Yeah, what what causes that to happen? This game loads really fast, though. Like, I mean, just really, really fast. Okay, that doesn't really do anything. Right. I, I thought I cleared a way in here, but oh we got I loaded, so no, I did not. Where am I going? Um, I'm going to Shion's. Because going underneath sounds like a good idea. Because there's none of those guys in here. Yeah, 
Yeah, before I go underneath, I'll uh, refill my life first. Hit the dive, I hit the dive, I hit the dive. What the heck was that? Oh, that machine gun flew like a mile. Okay, now we can go through the tunnels. I hear a bee. There it is. Wow, I already got. <sighs> I had one bee. Oh, there's another one. Cool. All right, so I used one to get one. You know what? I, I, that's okay. That that that's that's okay. I'm okay with that. Now the question is, how do I find out which one is holding a bee? I think I just gotta go through all of them. Mass slaughtering time. That's what it is. Yep, it's just mass slaughtering time. Oh, there it is. Got one. Don't use the item. Don't use the item. There it is. Cool. All right, now I just gotta wait for the nectar to wear off, although I don't know how long that takes. Uh, how do I get back up? How do I get back up? How do I get back up? This way. You know, it might be faster. I hate to say this. It might be faster just to empty this and just find another bee. Because you have no idea how long the nectar takes. And yep, as soon as I did that look, I found a bee. Look at that. Look at that mad skills. All right, that's not mad skills. That's kind of dumb luck. But at least I know now. Probably the best way to, to farm these things. And just go to Xion's uh, meat packing lap here. The best thing is I can get some heals via OJ. I can also get some free EXP here from these guys. Oh, love lot. I messed the giant swing. Oh, I'm Cesaro now. Cool. It's like one person in my audience that got that joke. <laughs> or got that reference even. Okay, uh, let's get on the bike. I need to go this way. I don't need a save because there is a save point in Isabella's area. Cool, I got a trophy for some reason. Uh, jump at least 33 feet. Neat. And then I got shot because I wasn't paying attention. Um, left, left. Get off, get off, get off. Nice. All right, so that's six Bs. Problem is I can't really have a lot of health when I do this. Gotta be careful. Uh, I, actually, I don't think I can spam it here. I know it's dangerous, so we got back. I know, I know, I know. Take this one. Will you, will you just take this, please? I finally managed to extract a bit of one more than me now. I was just mad of getting enough foot together. I'll take another five queens. Give me enough for the one one after. Perfect. I have just enough item space. Is that a blender? This is going to please me if I can not give the good work. Yeah. It's a blender, but I can't use it. I have 18 hours, and I only need four more bees. Oh, this is going really, really well. I just hope that... I kind of just hope that the game gives me extra time. Like, I have 18 hours. So what if the game gave me extra time to uh to uh just go and kill things? Oh, 
Okay, I think my last strategy worked really well. Thought I heard a bee. I'm going the wrong way. Just a chunk of meat. Oh, there's a bee. Sweet. Do not, do not use it. Do not use it. I almost pressed the button. I'm going the right way. Good, good, good. Fortunately, these guys are apart from each other, so I'm going to get hit no matter what I do. That was neat. Thought I saw these guys. What the heck is this? Okay, I have time, right? What is over here? Huh. It's like a little back way door. Flash shot, it freaked me out. Yeah, it's it's just like a, another hidden way to go. Neat. Am I going the right way? Yes, I am. Surprise! I feel like that one guy from, uh, from, uh, Dexter. And that awesome guy is always like, surprise, mother effer! That guy always cracked me up. It was like one of the best. One of the best characters on the show. I don't really care if I take hits here. Because, as I said before, there is a free health restore here. And now I don't need to go for the OJ, I just like OJ, okay? I mean, who doesn't like OJ? OJ is great. Man, I really want some OJ now. I wish I had some. I don't. Oh man, that sucks. I mean, I, yeah, I have some milk in the fridge. I mean, milk is good. I'd rather have OJ, but milk ain't bad. Maybe. Dang it. Can't hit it. Now, I know the same Final Fantasy tactics, but the elevation here is kind of annoying. <laughs> There's a bee. Sweet. Don't use it. It's kind of annoying how it, you know, when you pick it up, it, ch it changes to it. Oh, nice throw. I see, what, two more? That will probably have to get another chainsaw. Cause I mean, honestly, like this chainsaw has been through a lot. Like no duh, this this chainsaw has really been through a lot. Uh, there's a bike. There's a bike when I exit outside, and because there's a bike when I exit outside. Oh, hello. Hello there. Uh, because there's a bike when I exit outside, I can uh, ride that to the chainsaw. And that might be a good idea. Oh, this really is the best place to fight these guys. Like, I mean, what? There's about 10 of them every single time you come in here? If you do the math, that's what, 50,000 experience, basically? Not to mention a free heal. So let's go get a chainsaw. 
And I want to say before I, before I give this to Isabella, because if it ends my time, I think I don't know what the time end is. Like, let's say we cure his uh, zombification. Uh, do I still have only 16 hours before everything goes to hell? Or, or do I have now extra time? Like, not knowing that is a bit of a problem. Because I don't know if I'll be able to grind or not. One thing I do know, though, is... I'm getting myself a new chainsaw. Oh, there's also a, uh... Let's, um... Right. Nice. Still wish I could get rid of this hairdo, but... You know what? I will take the, uh... Take these clothes over those. Whatever those were. And it take any damage. That was cool. Whoa! You know... I, I had an idea that I formed in my brain. Uh, before I did anything. And I think it's a good idea. And the idea is to quickly just re-enter. And because I have no idea which chainsaw I've actually been using, uh, just replace a bolt. I mean, it takes all what? Like five, ten in-game minutes, possibly? But now I know I have two fully charged chainsaws. Jerk. I don't want to go this way, but he kind of shot at me, so I kind of have to. Oh, I just got shot. Dang it. It's hard to... It's hard to drive a bike when you're getting shot at. I don't know how the, all these action hero movie stars do it. I don't need stuff for a heal because I almost have enough for a level up. It's this way, right? Yes, it is. I did not pass it. To the left. Cool, 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 cool. You know what I could do is, um, save before I give her the last bee. I'm gonna save now, then give her the bees. And if... If, uh, it triggers the next event... What I could do is I could try to grind. Um, da, da, da. yeah, I could try to grind. I don't have the time now. With proper research, I should be able to make some sort of uh, zombie vaccine. Let's hope if we can make it out of here. Because there doesn't seem to be any other timeline except my zombie vacation. Just a little more, Frank. Soon we'll have all the home run we need. If I can get to, like, level 45, that'd be huge, I think. Plus, if I get more health. I'm going along now. Just one more art to do it. Okay, so let's save. And let's see if this triggers the next story event. Because if it does, then I just go back and load. And I don't trigger the next story event. I just hang on to this last B. And I could go get myself three more heals. I think that's a good idea. Let, let, let's test it out. You're gonna inject me with that, huh? 
Okay, Doc. Let's get this over with. At least I won't have to worry about turning into one of them for a while. Okay. Next on the agenda. Figure out a way to get the hell out of here. While I was isolating the hormone, I managed to identify a pheromone that suppresses the attack instinct in adult parasites. In other words, the zombies don't like the way it smells. If you give me a little more time, I should be able to produce some of this pheromone. They think it smells bad? You think we could use something like that to keep them away from us? We could just walk right past them and get out of here. In theory, yes. That sounds amazing. Either way, it's certainly better than nothing. There was a cave outside where the helicopter crashed. It was packed with zombies. I mean, shoulder to shoulder. Yeah, shoulder to shoulder. But it may lead somewhere outside. If it works, your anti-zombie perfume, it could keep us safe in that cave. What do you say? You ready to get the hell out of here? Well, once is all we'll need, hopefully. 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 Whatever you say. <sighs> okay. Do I have a timer? There's a lot of zombies. My God. There are so many. Where on earth could this lead? I don't think it leads in and we're on Earth. But considering how many of them keep pouring out of here, it must be connected to something. Isabella, look. Any other way out of here is guarded by the military. If we're gonna get out of here and put a stop to Carlito's plan, we've got to go in there. It's the only way. It's not like we're unarmed. We got your smelly perfume, don't we? <laughs> Hope that works. I wouldn't be alive right now if your shot hadn't worked. That's true. The perfume's gonna work too. I know it. I like how it shows that confidence in her. Truly really uplifting. I All mean, right. from a guy who was Let's go. ready yeah. to just die. To someone who's like, yeah, I believe in you. And I believe in your perfume. Let's dive into a pit full of zombies together. I mean, it, it's it's such a nice invigoration. I can save here. Okay, so I have a feeling. I have a feeling that there's no timer now. So what I have is I have a rare opportunity. To really make the most out of this game. And it's going to be incredibly repetitive. So I think I'm going to spare you. The uh. I'm going to spare you this. But. What I'm going to do. Is I'm going to head here. Paradise Plaza. I'm going to grab as many healing items as I can. Yeah I'm going to grab as many. Now I I'm thinking if I go to. If I go do this trick in Shion's, I might be able to get another item pip. So going to the Paradise Plaza right now is not the best idea. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to head to Shion's. And I'm going to grind here for about six in-game hours. Maybe eight. Then I'm going to go here. I'm going to get the drinks. Once I have full health, I'm going to go back here to replace the chainsaw I've been using. And then I'm going to come back here and I'm going to do that thing 
Now I'm going to meet back with you guys at this save point. Yeah, that, that sounds like a really good plan. So I will see you guys in a bit. Um, I know, I know exploring the mall is part of the fun of the game, but like I said, this is just, this is just pure circle grinding. What's circle grinding? Circle grinding is a term I give to RPGs. We just like literally run in a circle so you can get into fights so you can get stronger. That's all I'm doing here. I'm just circle grinding. So hopefully no one is uh, offended for me not showing the, the constant monotony of just running in and out, killing 10 guys, and running in and out and killing 10 guys. Because that's basically all I'll be doing. I'll, I'll be back. Welcome back, my friends. We are on the way through zombie hell. You may notice that my level is a very sparkly level 50 now. We have hit max level, which is just amazing. Uh, um, what do I do? Oh, there we go. Her perfume is really cool. Yeah, we hit level 50, and with level 50 came a bunch of really good things. Such as... Uh, such as item stocks, HP bonuses, chainsaws to the Isabel's face, uh, yeah, uh, also another cool thing was once we got like level 47, we got an attack up. And the cool thing about the attack up is we could go through the uh, special forces guys on one hit now with the chainsaw. So that was really, really cool. Oh my god, there is like an infinite amount of these guys in here. Oh my lord. Please don't stop chainsawing. You can't mash buttons when you get grabbed. Oh my god. Now the good news is, because of my item stock being ridiculously high, I have the ability to carry like six health drinks with me. A rock. Yeah, like I'm gonna pick up a rock or anything. I think I could just weave in and out of these guys. And look at that. Look at those mad skills. Probably better if I just kind of clear away. But yeah, there's definitely a way to get through this. Plus, if you use the, uh, the ungrabbable drink, which I have a few, that might be a better thing to do. Come on. Where you at? When you got the super perfume. Let's go, Isabella. Alright, she's coming. Look at that. Look how awesome that super perfume is. They're just dying left and right. But yeah, I could uh, use one of these drinks. And that should make it so that I don't even need to worry about getting grabbed. I can just go. Follow me. Look at this. Did she keep up though? Come on. Uh, she kind of can. What if I take her by the hand? But I'll go faster. Yeah, this is much faster. Nope. It's kind of not. Yeah, I mean, it's not bad. 
I mean, since I'm untouchable, we could just go. Although my untouchable is about to wear out any second. Oh, perfect timing. Perfect timing. Beautiful timing. The easier way to wade through infinite zombies. Are you sure this was a good idea? Guards here too. If we can get that gate open, they'll be too busy dealing with zombies to notice us slip by. Nice. Wait. The pheromone is starting to wear off. It's only strong enough to cover one of us. Well then you go. What are you? What Alright, hang doing? on tight, okay? Once we're out. Let's see if we can't steal ourselves that set of wheels. This is a bad idea, Frank. Oh, we got a save point. Look at that. How cool is that? They gave us a save point. That was nice one. All right, so what I think I'm gonna do is I'm gonna check another one of these. I'm, I really hope there is. I really hope I don't need so much healing in the future. Because with the untouchable, they can't grab me. And her fan won't kills them all. So as long as I hurry, I should be able to get through these guys without any problems. I just had to hurry. That's the key point. Gotta hurry. Oh. Um, uh, um, Frank? Chainsaw? Chainsaw? Bam on wall. Got the Jeep. Get in here. Let's go. Nice. Took two hits. That wasn't bad. That was very smooth. And I still had three healings left. Oh my god, that's a tank. You've got to be kidding me. What is this, Twisted Metal? Uh, how do I fire? There we go. I tried to press R and L, and none of it worked. Oh, I have infinite ammo. I think I gotta kill that thing up top. Because I think that's the aiming. Yep, yep, that's an aiming thing. Definitely need to take that out. It looks like hitting those things hurts it too. Take that out, need to take that out, need to take that out. It's so hard to aim. It is so hard to aim. Yes, I got it. Can't aim, can I? No. Just just one button. I tried I just tried all the other buttons by the way. Only but one button works. You gotta be kidding me. Come on, I hit that thing. I'm not doing well here. I'm not doing well. Yes, I got it. I got it. I got it that time. Okay, I got it that time too. Nerve-wracking. It's not like the the game we played so far, which is awesome. How they could throw a new element at you towards the end. Aim is hard. Aim is hard. Aim is hard. You got these little guys to worry about too. All right, I got it. I got it. I got it. 
Been doing really, really well here. Yeah, we're doing really, really well here. Come on, Frank. Come on, Frank. Oh my god. It just launched missiles at me. I haven't had enough time to hit this thing. Still got it. Cool, 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 cool. I've been doing really well here. Oh my god. 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 I hate it when this thing bounces up and down. It's hard to aim. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god! God, this is insane all of a sudden. Like, the difficulty has definitely picked up. Oh, I, I got the thing. Nice. Now hit the thing, hit the thing, hit the thing. Get that thing. I think I'm, I think I'm doing really well here. Despite my inability to shoot straight consistently. Uh, I'm, I'm still... Oh! As soon as I say something, I, I, get, I, get, I get screwed over. Uh, I need to shush. Stop talking, Flightless Bird. Just keep firing. I like how you can really see the tank getting more and more destroyed. It's really cool. Yeah! Woo! Oh. These uh -oh. automated machines are no use at all on the battlefield. Switch to manual control. Run, run, run. Pride. up the mall what'd you like to know on a mission in which the number of targets is unclear it's difficult to ensure absolute thoroughness <laughs> you have imagination that's what drives you in your quest to run your quest to hide as prey you and your kind are much more stubborn than the zombies how much do you know about the zombies i commanded the santa cabeza cleanup operation you were there if we had fulfilled our mission then we wouldn't be needed here now to take care he, of this he's the one that set all this up incident that's all it was to you, huh? A mission. What about those innocent people who had to pay for sins committed by our government our and its inhuman research? Our mistakes have not begun with this operation. <laughs> Humanity has proven itself to be quite adept at making mistakes. It's the only thing we truly excel at. Well then, I'd say this mission isn't quite over yet. Don't you agree?
What is he doing? Okay, I have no problem firing at the zombies. But hey, this is an opportunity to get him off guard. Oh, we're about to throw it down. Absolutely. Um, I have no items. Where are all my items? Where are all my items? All my items are gone. My magazines, everything. So I'm fighting him with fist. So it looks like I'm actually gonna have to use some of these moves I have been using. Uh, extending both arms and spinning in place. Let's hold L3 and square. That's that landing kick. Turn it up, press square while pushing downward. So I press square and X. Kick off a wall, that's cool. There's a wall here. Going's probably not good. Doubt that'll work. Right, swing, face pressure. You ain't got the organs. I don't think that's gonna work. So probably I could decap, uh, press X to jump and then meet press square. Press square to unleash the attack on zombies behind the prank. So it looks like one of my best moves is to press square and X. Or what is the, what is that, um... Hold R L3 and press square. Ah! Okay, that didn't work very well. I did not work very well. Stop holding back. Fantastic. Didn't need that, but oh well. God, but oh come on, I, I can't break out of this. I'm getting owned here. I am getting owned here. Okay, that chop seemed to work a little. My problem is... It's really hard to do. Like, it's not... It's not... Something that works all the time. Well, what is that downward thing? I'm gonna lose this fight because fighting on hand is not his fort. Um, I tried that, it didn't seem to work very well. By right, beginning, turn it up, press square while pressing L downward. Jesus. Can't even get up. Oh, I just hurt him really bad somehow. I think it was the kick. Yeah, that kick is just devastating him. He's like weak to the jump kick. I can win this. I can win this. I can win this. I still believe I can win. Oh my god. Um, get out of there. 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 
so close. Oh, it's so close. Yeah! Yeah! Kicks of steel! Woo! Look at those jump kicks. Go suck. Oh. How about just get sucked? Or eaten? I don't know. I mean, they're sucking its blood. I think they're just eating every part of them. They're not really sucking anything. But yeah, go die a horrible death. Now, how do we save the goal and get out of here? Well, we have a tank, don't we? Do we know how to drive a tank? Pretty sure it's not like... I mean, we drove a motorcycle. Frank, 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 Frank. Come on, buddy. <laughs> if that's the end of the game, I'm gonna be so mad. Unbreakable. Get the true ending without being knocked out. Nice. Infinity mode. Get the true ending. Oh, what's the true ending? I mean, get it like that! Just patient. Play this bird. Patient. I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure something else is gonna happen. Oh, uh, is that an army of zombies marching away? Because if so, that's really, really cool. I'm gonna say two to the credits for this one because it looks like you get extra things with the zombies hitting away. Although I can't promise that the music's gonna be in it because if I get copyright claim due to it, I'm gonna have to mute it. Sorry. I'm just gonna sit back and listen to this and jam out to it. I'll see you guys in after the credits.
I will say that's one of the coolest credit sequences there with the with the guys charging at you. Like so, we got at least 20 survivors out of the mall. Mega Man boots have been added to the security room. Mega Man tights, special forces boots, prisoner garb, and overtime mode, infinity mode, and epilogue. Penguin has managed to escape the town of Willamette with information printed and incident under his belt. The news caused a fervor throughout the world, leading to the the U.S. government to make at least partial culpability in the livestock research program. However, no connection to the Willamette incident was acknowledged, and the events that occurred there were deemed the work of a fringe terrorist group. The people of the world, as could be expected from the modern culture of news saturation, soon let the Willamette incident fade from their minds. The authenticity of Carlito's chilling plan to utilize the orphans as pawns is yet to be confirmed or proven false. And yet, he complained that his belly was not full. The heck does that mean? That is creepy. What was that? What was that? What was that? Like, seriously, creepy. Are you kidding me? That's that's how it ends. What the heck is this? Huh. Something I'm never gonna try to do, probably. But anyway, my name is the Flightless Bird. This is your survey skimming channel. This was our blind let's play of Dead Rising for the PlayStation. I really enjoyed the game. I, I think this game was a whole lot of fun, and I would have never played this if you guys didn't vote for it. So thank you all for voting for this game. And if you didn't vote this game and you voted for Siren, I'm pretty sure Siren will come back again another time. Uh, but I really, really enjoyed this game. It was a lot of fun. That's like the best way to describe it. It was fun. Yes, there's annoyances. And yes, the stupid dodge roll drove me absolutely insane. Uh, but the game is a lot of fun. And I, yeah, I, I just said that like five times. You know, it must be true. <laughs> I will, so I'm, I, I will say, though, I'm a little disappointed by the ending. Uh, nothing about Isabella. Nothing about Frank. I mean, there is something about Frank, but at the same time, uh, you know, it, what, just disappears? I mean, uh, I'm, I, I, I would have liked to have seen a more conclusive ending. Uh, but, I mean, the, the game, it, it, it leaves you hanging there. And uh, what the heck do those red words mean about his belly not being full? I have, I have no idea. Uh, is that setting up uh, the sequel or what's going on? But I really feel like I really want to see more out of what happened to Frank and what happened to Isabella. Uh, because you got you got attached to the character over time. And because of that, uh, I, I, yeah, I, I mean, I'm, it's, it's just one of those things where I, I really, 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 really wanted a closure ending. Instead of an up in the air ending. Because that really feels like an up in the air ending. And I, I, I... I want to see more. Um, but again, if a game leaves you wanting to see more, then it's it does its job, right? It, it's a pretty good game. Uh, yeah, uh, I do have, I do have, uh, walk, I do have the Dead Rising uh, two and three as a recommended. So one of these days, you know, we could probably play Dead Rising two and three, and I, I think that sounds like fun. Uh, before we leave though, I do want to say a huge thank you, first off, to everyone who voted on this game. Secondly, for everyone who watched the game and who liked the playthrough, who commented on the playthrough, uh, who talked to me about it on uh, Discord. I really do appreciate you all. And of course, I need to give a shout out to our wonderful, amazing Patreon and YouTube members of the channel. Fleeting Day, Ian Nell F. Patak, Tapas, Chinook DT, Techno Trouble, Diesel Knight, Draggy, Moose Gaming, and... Daddy X Dagoth. Thank you all for all your continued support. Uh, I can't say how much it means to me. You guys are just amazing. And I, I you just, you just blow me away. Uh, if you would like to support me in that way, there is a link in the description below. Uh, additionally, there's a link to a spreadsheet that has all my playthroughs. And there's also a link to uh, my Discord. You know, just check the uh, description. It's got everything you need to know. Uh, I will say that I'm not done with this game yet. I really feel like this game needs a Silent Hill treatment. And what do I mean by that? I need to go and get all the endings and then make an ending guide video like I do with Silent Hill. 
Uh, I, I really feel like this game probably needs that. Uh, we'll see. I, I do know Castle of Fake Stone comes out next week. So I definitely need to make sure I get that done before that. And that's going to be really hard to do. But then again, with level 50, I mean, it shouldn't be that hard. Right? 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 <laughs> But hey, I, I love you guys all so very much. Tell me your know, thoughts and comments in the description box below. Did I miss something? Uh, I really need to know because if I miss something, I need to go back and get it and make sure I show it off. Uh, so, yeah, I, I like I said, I, I enjoyed this game. It was a lot of fun and I would have never played it without you guys. So thank you for voting. Uh, the next game in our horse slots could be uh, the Castle of Stone. Then it's going to be a point and click adventure chosen by you all the community. Then it's going to be The Walking Dead Season 2. Uh, including that is a DLC for 100 days. Um, then it will be my choice of Point and Click Adventure. And then it will be your choice of horror. So that's kind of how this time slot works over the next couple of months. Uh, are you going to vote for Dead Rising 2? Or are we going to vote for Siren? And y'all are going to give me nightmares. Because this game didn't give me nightmares. But just watching the Siren trailer, that kind of did give me nightmares. So I don't know. <laughs> Oh boy. <laughs> I love you guys. I'll talk to you very soon. Thank you again. And until next time, my dear friends, so long and take care. Thank you for watching this video. Feel free to comment on what you saw and what you'd like to see next. I always love to hear your thoughts. But before we go, please remember that you matter and you are brilliant and you are loved and you should always be true to yourself. Never let the world tell you any different. Much love to you from your friendly, feathered, flightless bird.